Welcome back to another video from how to fix online. In this video, I will be showing you how to fix Avis application not working on your iPhone. Avis application aims to provide a seamless rental experience, allowing you to skip lines and manage your car rental efficiently. Sometimes while operating the application, you might walk through some issues with the application version. So here are some troubleshooting steps you can follow to resolve the problem. If you are currently using the Avis application and it is malfunctioning, then the first thing you can do is to force close the app. Swipe up from the bottom of your screen to access the app switcher. Find the Avis app card and swipe it up or off the screen to force quit it. Once you force quit the Avis app, the next thing you would want to do is restart your iPhone. Press and hold the power switch of your iPhone and turn off your iPhone. Now then, turn it back on again and go to your app store. In the search box, type in Avis and search. Once you find this application, check if there is an update button available. Tap on update if available and updating the application can often resolve compatibility issues. So after you do that, you might be able to fix your issue. If the problem still continues, then consider reinstalling the Avis app. Go ahead and find the app from your app drawer and press hold the app for a few seconds. In the pop-up, tap on remove app, tap on delete twice. Soon after you do that, you will be able to delete your Avis app. Now go back to your app store and reinstall it again. Once you reinstall the app, the corrupted files or settings within the app might be causing the issue will be deleted as well. Now if none of those steps work, the next thing you'd want to do is to check for your iOS updates. Always make sure that your iPhone is running the latest iOS version. Go ahead and launch open the settings app and then from the settings menu tap on general. Now from the general tab tap on software update. Check if there is an available update for your iOS device. If there is one, you will be provided with a list. Simply go ahead and download the latest version of your operating system for your iPhone. Soon after you do that, you might be able to fix your issue right away. Now go back to Avis app and check if that works or not. So those were some of the fixes you could try and follow to fix Avis application not working on your iOS device. If you found the video to be helpful, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel by hitting the subscribe button. Press the bell icon so that you'll never miss another upcoming upload from us. I will be back again in the next video. Thank you.